Hi guys, it's Denise. It is Friday, January 20th, and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you. I have been going to the Dollar Tree on and off the past week, and Eldersburg, Pitts, terrible, terrible, terrible. Westminster, you know, um, the manager still, whatever, um, not the greatest, but the store is starting to get some new items, and um, I found the good stuff. It's so funny when I was checking out today, the cashier and another lady were like, you must watch uh, TikTok because you got all the good stuff. I was like, well, I watch YouTube and TikTok. I didn't say, oh, I do. Uh, I have a channel. Um, I probably showed up, but I didn't. Um, but it's true. I said, I watch my friends and they show me what's going on in those stores. And then I come home and I want to show it too. So that's what I'm doing today. I found this. that they, The girl was like, oh my gosh, I want to go back and get some of it. Um, I found the real simple uh, all-purpose cleaner this is the cherry blossom and rose scent I was super super excited about this um, I I don't I, I was trying to I guess figure out what stores sell this but this is a name brand this is like a big deal this is a big deal I have not I did not check and see what it sells for normally but um, I got two of them and I cannot wait to use this uh, this is it just says it's safe around kids and pets cleans without harsh chemicals safer choice so it's 24 ounces that is a super super deal so I grabbed up two of those last week when I was there I've been doing uh, low carb not full keto but low carb and I'm gonna be reaching down and grabbing because I've got bags all around me this is a, my new barn door in my salon and we started painting so I can't wait to give you a full tour when it's finished right now it's a trashed mess because we can only do it um, a little at a time but I love this barn door that we just got we ordered it from Amazon actually and um, my husband and I put it put it up so let me show you I've been um, like I said I've been doing low carb not not full keto excuse me and um, again I follow people on TikTok and I you know find new recipes and things and there's a lady that I follow who does who makes these uh, protein puddings so I found and I think this is a huge deal um, the chocolate muscle monster protein energy shake so what you'll do is you get this and then you get some sugar-free pudding chocolate pudding whatever and you mix them together I think she does like half of the sugar-free packet of pudding uh, dry pudding and you mix it all together and you have a nice uh, protein pudding so it's sugar-free jello half package of sugar-free jello pudding dry and then one of these and you have a nice you have a nice dessert and and you don't feel guilty about it so I grabbed uh, chocolate and vanilla let me see I need to search for my vanilla here it is um, so I grabbed the vanilla also and again this is 27 grams of protein and um, this is awesome like this is a deal I was at Dollar General because I'm looking I was I'm looking for some something in particular at Dollar General and they um, had the uh, cake batter but it was like the pure protein something like that maybe that's what it's called premier protein and it was probably three three twenty five which which isn't terrible because I like buying single um, portions I guess because I don't want to buy a whole like case because they sell them either six packs or cases um, and I think this is a this is a big deal you can you can actually even split this up you don't have to drink it at one time you can split it up but I bought the chocolate and the vanilla when I went back today no bueno they were all gone so all of those were gone and then I picked up which to me this was like one of my big my big scores was the uh, the kinders no sugar um, this one is the teriyaki with sesame and ginger and it is really good I made some ground chicken a little bit of uh, rice and um, broccoli last night and put this on it and it was good so if you're looking for some sugar-free sauces because again groceries are nuts um, if you can find stuff like this at the Dollar Tree it's worth it it is worth it and I don't know what the expiration date is on this I don't know I don't know these are it's hard to see and my I've got my like dingy glasses on because all my glasses are broken I went to um, America's Best on Monday and um, I'm not order I got my eyes examined but I'm not ordering my glasses through there so I have to wait on my new glasses I have my I went and got my oil changed this morning I've been a busy busy bee uh, sorry about the crinkly bag so this um, I thought this was a, a really really fun find the uh, Lady Boba 
This one is the brown sugar uh, bubble tea. Brown sugar uh, boba is one of my favorites. We have a, a bubble tea uh, place right by my work and um, I haven't been there in a while. Uh, but the, the brown sugar is my absolute favorite. The one thing I forgot to do is look for the big straws. So this has got the tapioca pearls inside here and it is so, so yummy. I have not tried this one yet, but I'm sure it is delicious. Uh, this just says Lady Boba on it. And it is, what does it say? It just says drink, 10.7 full ounces. It's got 181 calories and it is one serving, I think. So this is a meal. A nice snack a meal but it is a fun fun thing I don't know if you've ever tried uh, bubble tea oh this doesn't even expire until um, 2024 so put them on your shelf put them in your like your pantry save them up fun 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 find let me see oh and then I found this super coffee blueberry muffin I don't know if you've seen these in your store if you see them, grab them. Again, these things are not these things sell for a lot more than $1.25 in uh, regular stores in Walmart, your grocery store. So this just says positive energy, zero added sugars, 10 grams plant protein, 200 uh, milligrams caffeine. It is plant based and it is 80 calories. So it is um, coffee. It is just like iced coffee, I guess. Let's see. Uh, it says it all started. I'm not going to read all that. Um, when we reimagined coffee and replaced the negatives with positives, like protein, MCT oil, and no sugar, natural sweetener, super coffee was born. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Let's see. And it, okay. Um, from super coffee to super creamer and everything in between. You'll tap. Okay. So this is just a drink. This is this is two cups of coffee is what it says on the back. This is equivalent to two cups of coffee. So be on the lookout for those. If you're a coffee lover, grab them up. Grab them up. Like I said, this was fun. This, these were fun finds. All right, what's next? What is next? Okay, I picked up some more pickles uh, because pickles are um, you know a good snack, a good healthy snack. And uh, I was watching again on TikTok, a girl doing a snack, and it was, she put a piece of cheese on um, a pan, a skillet, and then she cooked it, got it nice and crispy, and she put a pickle, uh, a pickle inside of it and rolled it up and had that as a snack. So I did that yesterday. It was absolutely delicious. And that was my last pickle. So I grabbed two jars of the Bur Brickenridge Farms kosher dill, kosher dill pickles, and these are super, super good. I put them in my salad and just have them as a, as a little snack. And another fun find I found was the hazelnut spread uh, with coca. So this is basically just the Nutella and Wyatt loves Nutella. And uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. It's hard for me to see. It says Mad Madigan's. I guess that is the, the name. Madigan's hazelnut spread with coca. So be on the lookout for that. And then I found another, I found this one today, I think. Lady Boba, and this one is taro. That is the, the flavor. So um, I grabbed this one too, and the same goes for this. It doesn't expire until 2024. So I grabbed it that. Let's see. Again, they were really putting out a lot of food. Uh, just a lot of a lot of good stuff. I was really really I, you know I love finding food at the Dollar Tree. It's one of my favorite things to do is to find food at the Dollar Tree. Um, I also found this um, Wana Bana. Hopefully I'm saying it right. No preservatives, gluten free, natural fruit smoothie, no sugar added, mango passion fruit banana. So Wyatt usually likes these, and this is a huge size. They sell the three packs of the smaller ones at the Dollar Tree, but this one is 8.45 ounces so I grabbed up this flavor where's the expiration date on here I don't see it uh, this one also 2024 grabbed up that one and I didn't grab a bunch because I didn't know if he would like them but I'm pretty sure he will and this one is strawberry orange banana beet oh I should have grabbed more of those because beet is beets are so healthy for you 
So be on the lookout. This is great for traveling. Just a healthy, healthy snack. It is 100 calories, and this is one serving size. This whole thing is one serving. So it is high in carb, but you know what? It's got veggies and stuff like that, whatever. Um, it's good for you. So be on the lookout for those. So that was a good find for me. What else do I have in here? I picked up some, some more dog food for Posh. This is the first time I've seen this. Um, this, this size can and this brand of the Nature's Corner Country Chicken Stew Dog Food. It says it's made with real chicken, 100% complete and balanced for adult dogs. No artificial favor, flavors and no artificial preservatives. And this by December 25. So that's what the, the can looks like if you're looking for any of that. I bought the chicken and I also bought the beef. So we'll, we're going to give that a try. So I've been holding this in my hand, so I need to show it. Uh, I've been using a lot of my Freeman uh, peel-off masks because I just like them. It makes me feel good to, to rip it off. I feel like I'm pulling off while it is to getting my clogged pores and everything clean. This one is Freeman Cleaning Clearing Peel-Off Clay Mask. Sweet Tea Lemon, and it brightens. It says Purifant. Um... What is it lemon yeah sweet tea and lemon so there's that this would be great for like a little in, a, in an Easter basket for like a teen or a mom somebody um, and these are really really nice I've been bringing out lots and lots of Freeman products I'm really looking for some of the uh, face masks other than that let me pull this bag closer hopefully I can get it all right so when I was at the Dollar Tree last week, I handed the girl um, some things that I did not want and um, I think she bagged them and didn't scan them. So I ended up coming home because I looked on my receipt and um, they weren't on my receipt. So she evidently um, ended up giving them to me, um, which was very nice of her. It was an accident. It was, it was an accident, I know for certain because we discussed it. I was like, I can take it back if you want. She was like, no, no, I got it. And then she just put it in, just put it in a bag for me. So um, I picked up this beautiful, it's kind of bent, um, four leaf clover, tin uh, initial. And it is so pretty. You can see it, you can probably see it now. See it there? See it in front of my shirt? It's really cute. I was even thinking about um, getting a, a green shirt, even a green sweatshirt, and then uh, spraying bleach and um, making myself a cute little St. Patrick's Day shirt. So that's a possibility. I'm not, I'm not certain, but it's a possibility. So that one I think I got for free. And then um, I had these shirts because I was like, oh, I don't think I'm gonna get them. This is just a plain, I think it's gray, all style, uh, youth long sleeve t-shirt. And this is for Wyatt. It is too, I think it's too small for Jesse. So I grabbed him that. And then I picked up these green t-shirts for St. Patrick's Day. Again, I wasn't going to buy them. They look black right here, but they are green. And they ended up in my bag anyway. And these are Jersey's Sports. So I grabbed those two. Then I picked up, got these today, I think. The Arm & Hammer Foaming Garbage Disposal Cleaner with Baking Soda. This is awesome. I think this is actually a pretty good deal. Uh, this, um, their like, cleaner aisle was immaculate. It, it was so wonderful to see. And um, I saw this and I thought, yes, I definitely, definitely need this. So be on the lookout for that. I picked up these uh, colored pencils. These, I guess it says Prang Colored Pencils. It's 36 and this is a really nice package really nice package and um, I also picked up but I don't know if I'm gonna show it uh, why it's one of white's teachers sent in a little note about um, donations she needed tissues and dry eraser marker markers so I picked those up also but I don't think I'm going to show you and then I picked up this home luminaire direct light where you need it multi directional pivoting head light and it's a wall mount and I bought these for my salon and I'm not really sure where I'm going to put them uh, I just thought that was awesome what a great like are you kidding me from the Dollar Tree plug-in LED wall mount lamp 
and it says Energy Star. And um, let's see what else. Non-dimmable, but that is fine. Plug-in wall mount. Cool to the touch. Let's see. I don't know if you can see that. It's hard to see. You see that picture? It's right up here. I mean, right next to that bed like that. Like, this is nice. This is really, really nice. I picked up, I had four, uh, but the uh, the lady in front of me uh, was like, where did you get those? And I know I picked them all up. And I was like, there isn't any more left. And she was like, oh, I said, you know what, to the cashier, I said, can you scan one and give it to her? Because um, I'm sure I don't need all four, but I definitely needed at least two. So um, I gave that to her. So she was happy about that. So I'm excited to see how these look. I am really excited to see how these look. Let me see, where else am I? I also picked up, every time I see these, I'm like, oh, I should buy them. And then when I go back, they don't have any more. This is just the Hung Hungry Jack Original Hash Brown Potatoes, ready in minutes and just add water. And this is a great emergency food. Seriously, add hot water and, um, I mean, you have to cook them, but, uh, it's it's kind of fast and easy it's what freeze-dried so if you see them grab them and put them in your emergency pantry let's see what the date is but I'm not kidding you they go um, quick there is a sell best buy but I don't see it, it just says two I don't see it I don't see it oh well no big deal no big deal I picked up some of the new fields uh, garlic croutons and this really isn't a deal because when I was at Aldi today, they have them at, for like 98 cents at Aldi, but they were a dollar, dollar twenty-five, and I was there and I was like, you know what? Let me just get it. And then I picked up some of this Jim Beam coffee because it's delicious. And for some reason, a, a couple days ago, we ran out of coffee. Like what? I I never I never run out of coffee. So I did have the um, it was Harry and David coffee that they had over the holidays. I was able to supplement with that, but this Jim Beam coffee tastes so good. So this is an emergency coffee, keep in your pantry, um, just in case, you never know, you open it up and there's no coffee in there and that ruins, that can ruin a morning. Can definitely ruin a morning. Um, oh, I picked up these stuffed puffed, stuffed puffs cookies and cream marshmallows. I still have some from, but I guess the hearts. And you know, even though they feel like a little a little stale, when you put them on top of that fire, I actually burn mine. I love a burnt marshmallow. So um, I saw these and I picked them up. And these are actually pretty expensive in the store. So again, if you see them in your store, grab them up because it is, it is definitely worth it. And that is for a fun evening of roast and marshmallows. And this is cookies and cream. The, the heart ones I have would just have solid chocolate in it. And it makes for an easier s'more. You don't have to add your chocolate to it. Or you can just have extra chocolate if you want. So I grabbed up those and where is the expiration date on this one? I don't know. I don't see it and I'm not going to search for it. So there's that. I also picked up this cute little Valentine's Day bingo cards because I figured maybe we could just have fun at home. Um, the big kids can come over and we can play bingo and have some prizes. I think that would be kind of fun. Um, so I got that and they had a bunch of different ones and this one is just Sweet Treat Valentine Bingo and it's just got um, ice creams and things like that. So it would be fun if it was like a, a cookie bingo or cupcake bingo, something like that. Really make some cookies, make some cupcakes and when you win, you win a cookie or a cupcake. So I uh, got that, I thought that was pretty cute. I picked these up for uh, Posh, my little Chihuahua, the Sweetheart Snacks Milk Bone uh, Treats. That's for her for Valentine's Day. I thought that was so adorable. I got her the little Christmas bones and now they have the Valentine's Day bones. I picked up for Wyatt and I'm gonna go to the Dollar Tree in Eldersburg hopefully tomorrow and look for more because they only had two of these. This is the Scratch and Reveal Valentine craft kit and their stickers and I would like these to be Wyatt's Valentine cards. I don't think Jesse's class is going to be doing Valentine's. They did do Christmas cards, uh, but I think Wyatt would like would like these in his Valentine's Day cards. So there's only six in a pack, so I need quite a few packages of that. 
Um, I also picked up some Bolero Lavender and Honey Facial Wipes because I am almost out of my wipes and I love the smell of lavender. I picked up another one of these gnomes because Wyatt's going to be starting another after school program uh, the end of February and his teacher, I gave her a cute little Christmas gnome last year so this year I'm going to give her a St. Patrick's Day one since she won't be there, he won't be doing it for Valentine's Day but he'll be there for St. Patrick's Day so this guy was really cute so I'll give her that and a couple other little treats because she's very sweet and uh, very patient and uh, I don't know, it's fun getting a nice little and I, she says what she does when, when she what she did with the other gnome is she kept it on her desk and she said it made so many people happy so hopefully she gets to do the same with this one and then I found this guy I was so happy to find him he has got a friend upstairs so I grabbed this one and I'm not buying any more of the uh, Valentine's Day gnomes just because now I feel like my collection is complete and I just really liked this um, sweater pattern I had a sweater like this when I was a young girl and it kind of reminds me of that. Grabbed up that guy. And then let me see what's in this. Ooh, okay. Again, another TikTok thing. I was watching somebody making Snickers, like Snickers bars out of dates. So these dates are delicious. I made some yesterday. I have sugar-free chocolate. I use sunflower butter, sunflower peanut butter, um, dates and pecans and a little bit of sea salt. You split your date open, you put your sunflower butter or peanut butter, whatever you want to use. Uh, you put, you melt your um, sugar-free chocolate or regular chocolate, chocolate, whatever you want to do. And then you put pecans on it and you put it in the freezer. I put mine in the refrigerator and they taste like Snickers. It is absolutely delicious. You could do, you could do that hazelnut. You could probably get everything you need at the Dollar Tree. To, to make them and it's a healthier treat I mean this is a fruit it's not I mean, you everything you you know everything that you're putting on it so I grabbed up two packages of these dates because I just really I really really like them they taste so good I found a little bit of makeup at the Dollar Tree mine has just been not good with makeup but I feel like everything else has been has been great um, I bought some more of the um, see the blurring powder this one is the light to medium essentially ageless I absolutely recommend and love this I am using um, an HD powder uh, upstairs it's just kind of a white HD powder and this my HD powder is $40 I pay $40 for it and you can get this at the Dollar Tree for $1.25 and it is phenomenal that it is absolutely phenomenal so this is the light to medium by be pure essentially ageless blurring pressed powder get it stock up on it it is a steal I like I said I can't I can't say enough good things about it and I love the um, the concealer and the foundation that's what I'm that's what I'm wearing it's it's been amazing here's the here's the uh, foundation essentially ageless hydrating serum foundation right here and this one is also light medium grab them if you see them grab them they have a couple darker colors also but this super steel it feels great on my face um, I sometimes have um, I'm sometimes sensitive to things like this but right here right here friends this is what you want this is absolutely what you want and um, I, again I just can't say enough about it so be on the lookout for those grab them up put them away for aging skin absolutely a must and then I found this blotted okay Revlon lip color it says this is 009 blotted lip color Revlon kiss cloud so I grabbed that I don't know it looked kind of good I don't know if it's matte ultra so okay ultra silky transforms into a smooth diffuse soft matte finish airy color as soft as a cloud Effort, effortless diffused silky matte so um be on the lookout for that that I, that this was kind of a surprise like i said we haven't had anything new any new um makeup i got another little basket for my um my wall hanging i'm going to put this maybe above my shampoo bowl 
uh, for shampoo and things, but we'll see. I'm not sure. I don't want to make any. I don't want to make any bad decisions because once it's up, it's up. And then I bought this Epsom salt. It's magnesium sulfate. Um, it's two pounds. I thought this was a super deal. It's by White Mountain. And um, let me show you. That's amazing. Two pounds. One of my clients. We were. I was talking again. TikTok. Um, I was talking to her about that. Like I was getting my bath. I have a, um, a garden tub and we never use it. Uh, and she was like, why wouldn't you use it? I go, I just don't, I just don't. And she says she takes a bath every night and she uses Epsom salt. And I was seeing how someone, people use it to pull, um, impurities out of your body. And they, that's how they get, like if they've been sick, things like that, it, it pulls it out. It's called pulling, I guess. She says she takes a bath in Epsom salt every single night and she's never sick. What? What? So... I'm gonna have to try this. So I got two bags of that, which I think that's a really good deal. I know Epsom salt isn't expensive, but $1.25 for a two pound bag, I thought that was a great deal. And let me see, oh, here we go. So I was so excited. I was watching my friend uh, Frugal J on her channel and she was showing these beautiful Kendall and Kylie bags. And I was like, what? what gosh I hope my store gets them and today I was circling the store and circling the store and the last aisle I went in was the school um, section the school supply section and um, there they were there they were so I bought every single one um, Wyatt possibly has a birthday party to go to this weekend and I bought a bunch of little things and I'm going to put um, her stuff in this cute little cute little bag this is the Kendall and Kylie mini backpack and this one is so precious it's just a really really light purple with rainbows and a unicorn so I grab. I wanted to buy well, I, did, I bought every pattern every single pattern this one I love for myself I love that black and white check we're going to uh, Disney in no not until November but I think this might be too small for that but I don't, I don't know. I mean, I would still, I would wear it one day, maybe. So this one is for me. I love this. It looks like Vans. I love that black and white check pattern. This one is so cute. Let me show you the back too. So cute. I love this. This is just a little nautical theme. And it's got the white, white straps on the back. So you have just little an anchors. This one's beautiful. These are lemons. And this soft pink, some lemons and the soft pink. These cute little rainbows and this baby blue. It's a duplicate. And then these little tiny butterflies. So cute. So cute. I was so excited to find them. So excited to find them. Uh, let's see. I think that's I think that's it. You don't really want to see my parchment paper, do you? And my Ziploc bags. I bought some more Ziploc bags because I have a, um, it's like a Uncrustable maker. So I'm gonna make some Uncrustables for the boys, peanut butter and jelly, and freeze them and put them in these glad bags because it's why I said he likes his to a little frozen. So I said, okay, so I'm going to be making those for them today. And you know what, I think that's it. This has been like 30 minutes, 30 minutes. This is a super, super long haul. But I wanted to show you guys everything that I got. And to me, I think I got a ton of great stuff. So be on the lookout in your store for the Real Simple Cleaners, the Monster Energy Drinks, the Kinders, um, Zero Sugar uh, Marinates, the Smoothies, the Boba Tea, all of this stuff, guys, because things are just going to get more expensive. I did see eggs today were down to $4.49 at Aldi instead of $5.00 you know, whatever. Um, so, you know, every, you have to really watch every dime. You have to watch every single dime. And when I go into the Dollar Tree, I go, um, I do have a plan. I'm not just going in to buy a bunch of junk. I feel like I go in to buy things that I need, some things that I want, some things that I find. Do I need all those little backpacks? Do I need all these? I don't. I really don't, but they were really cute. So, um, and I'll find homes for them. I definitely will find homes for them. So guys, thank you so much. Thank you for watching. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, I would love for you to do so. My name is Denise. This is Denise's Halls. I go to Walmart, Aldi, 
and the Dollar Tree. And um, I have a Timu haul. I'm waiting for my next order to come in and I'm gonna do a big, a big haul and show you. Um, I'm trying to build my channel back up. I had a channel a few years ago and I just deleted it because I was really overwhelmed. And now um, I started doing it again because I love going to the Dollar Tree and I love telling you what I bought. So, um, so that's what I'm doing. So again, like, share, subscribe. If you have not yet subscribed to my channel, please, I would love it. I would love for you to do so. And um, I think that's about it. So guys, have a great weekend and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.